There's a new temporary home for Taste of Omaha outside the city. Thanks for joining us. I'm Bill Shamrins. I'm Julie Cornell. Quinicia is off. Event organizers announced this year's festivities will be in Ralston at Liberty First Credit Union Arena and the Greenery. That's where KTV News Watch 7's Alex McLuhan is live with the change in venue. Alex. Bill, Julie, one vendor says they're excited they get to plan for this, and another is just impressed that organizers were able to pull this off. And now the mayor is looking forward to welcoming thousands who hope to venture down here next month. One of the things we've been trying to do is really create an atmosphere that would bring events like this to the city of Ralston. Ralston is capitalizing on this $250 million development off I-80, pairing Liberty First Credit Union Arena and the Granary in order to deliver Taste of Omaha 2023, after Omaha rejected director Mike Mancuso's liquor license for Elmwood Park. We reviewed many, many different ideas, but right away, um, one of the first locations that was mentioned to us and uh, Mayor Don Grosser and his team put together an excellent plan. Vendors will pitch their tents and trailers in the parking lots outside these neighboring event spaces. It was built just for things like this. It's a multi-purpose facility, as you can see, with outdoor spaces, indoor spaces, big screen stage, indoor restrooms, air conditioning, all kinds of things that will make an event like Taste of Omaha just be pulled off like a dream. Hosting Taste of Omaha 2023 means a lot of sales tax revenue for Ralston. Don't have a number. I hope it's a million dollars, but I, <laughs> I hope you do that good a job. Hoping for thousands to turn out this year, Taste of Omaha will reunite with the riverfront in downtown Omaha next year, where crews are currently landscaping, pouring concrete, and installing permanent amenities. We were not going to do it unless we found the right opportunity. And this, as you can see, is there. If you come to Taste of Omaha this year, the director says entry and parking around the event venues is free. Vendors are allowed to serve alcohol this year, and organizers plan on providing a free shuttle for transportation from each venue. Live in Ralston, Alex McLoon, KETV News Watch 7. Alex, thank you. Omaha Mayor Gene Stothard is weighing in on the move tonight, telling KETV News Watch 7, while she would have preferred Taste of Omaha to remain at Elmwood Park in 2023 before moving back to the riverfront, Ralston and Omaha are good neighbors, and she says she's pleased they could secure a venue for this year.